Hello, everyone. As you may or may not know, my name is Yasmin Verdi. That is my stage name. And this is your tutorial for the DCBAConvention.com website. Some people may have a little difficulty navigating websites, even in today's technological world. So I figured I would give you a walkthrough of the website and how you can utilize everything on there and explain a few things as well. There are going to be a few other videos on this channel that can help you along when registering for the DCBA convention and also talking about DCBA as a whole. All right, so follow along with me. You can pause at any time during this video to help yourself figure out some stuff that I'm talking about. And um, I'm going to be doing screen share, which I am per currently in showing the website. So we're already on the website and the website is www.dcbaconvention.com. Very easy to remember. And I also have the link below so you can easily click on it, follow. So again, this is just for the desktop version and also works for the iPad or tablet, whichever you may have, and a laptop and a home desktop. As far as the cell phone version, I'm going to do a separate video for that because that's a little bit different than this. And it does not look like this because cell phones are limited in what they can show you when you're on a cell phone for an actual website. They don't work as well. So we always recommend you try to use a desktop, a laptop, a tablet to view a full internet-based website. But if you only have your cell phone, we will be doing a video on that as well. If you cannot figure it out as of yet, we have made a more basic version for certain pages for the cell phone version. So you may be able to utilize those things. All right. So let's go ahead and jump in. Now, you may have to do full screen, of course, to zoom in and see this. But I'm going to explain everything here. So once you load the website up, what you will see here is the name of the convention the year that we're probably in we will be on our seventh annual year and these are the dates this is where you will always find the dates as i'm circling here and then the location for the convention also here on the side you will see a small breakdown of what to expect of the convention three days of instruction two performance shows two lectures with lunch body and self-acceptance event then over here on this side, you will see our mascot. His name is Dionysus, if you do not know that. This is his uh, cartoon version of his unicorn form. And then we here we have his demigod version of himself, meaning partially human, partially unicorn, which they also call, I believe, Animorph. So as you can see here, and um, yeah, actually he has a... Uh, a realistic version of his unicorn form, who I just have never put that version out yet, but we will get to that. And then you'll see our small logos up here in the corner, which is also Dionysus. Then below Dionysus, you'll notice there is a click here, become a festival mythical friend button. You can actually click on that. And this is a optional thing that you can do to be a part of the convention. And as you notice the top landing page does not change our banner, but you will scroll down when the page is loaded. And here you'll have um, explanation of what the Mythical Friend program is, which is pretty much you joining our Patreon and donating monthly or whichever you would like to do. And you get perks for being a Mythical Friend. Um, this gives you perks at the convention when you come. So you can register through just clicking this button. It'll take you to the Patreon page. And it also explains a little bit about us and what our cause is. I will read a little bit of it to you real quick before we go back to navigating. What our, What's our cause? We fight for everyone to have a place they feel acceptance, true acceptance, no judgments, no ins, no. <clears throat> no judgments, only inspirations, pardon me. We don't do clicks here. Creativity and expression of oneself. We do this by offering dance workshops, creativity workshops, and informative body workshops, along with the full event. This event also offers performance opportunities, fun, and togetherness. This event helps fight against things like bullying, segregation, and body shaming. We build confidence, acceptance, and sharing of the arts. Help us keep these things alive by becoming a mythical festival friend. Attending our sharing helps spread the word. That being said, as you can see, um, we have quite a few things going on before you even get any further on there. So let's go back to the home page here. 
All right, so that is loaded. And if you notice on the desktop version, when you mouse over, there are other pages that that's connected to very specific pages. So like the workshop schedule page has instructors, workshop description Saturday and workshop description Sunday on those. Then you have the mobile workshop schedule page. That's specifically for the cell phone so that way you can view the same workshop schedule for the desktop version, but the cell phone version is accessible there. You can access it here on the desktop version, but it's made specifically for the cell phone version so that way you can actually look at the schedule without it being messed up because it doesn't, the workshop schedule basic page does not load on the cell phone because it's too complicated for it. Now the home page button is literally the page you come on when you load up the website. Then on that one you have, um, pardon me, always getting little bleeps. The home page, um, you will see about DCBA, which tells you a little bit about our mission. And then the testimonials from people who have attended and then sponsors that we may have that year. Then I'll use Summit page. That page, before I click on it, is something new that we're doing. We're trying to help children in the community um, build confidence in themselves. It starts very young, so we believe in fighting for that. That's a new thing that we will be doing, which won't be happening now until August 2021 but we are taking donations for it. We have received some donations from our community, which is very extremely helpful. Um, we actually are having a um, raffle at the convention. We're a basket raffle. People, Some people have tickets already. And then when you donate, you do get some tickets as well. So you could win a wine basket or a family movie night basket. Um, that's something that you can win. So we're trying to build money for that event so we can have it. It's free to attend for the children and their parents. And it's a uh, three workshop setting where the children get to take all three workshops and rotating through. And it's from ages, I believe we have ages uh, five to 16. Um, but yeah, so, and also kids who are, was it, I think we, no, it's um, ages five through 14 or 15, I want to say. And then the kids older than that can volunteer to help and get their volunteer time for school. Um, and then we have our venue page, which shows you about the hotel and getting your room booked. And then we have food offerings on that page as well, because usually we always try to offer food every year because, of course, people like to eat. <laughs> um, then we have the apply to perform page. This one, it obviously, it speaks for itself. And that information is on that page. And then we have the shop and register page, which shows you how to purchase workshops and um, merchandise and anything else that is for sale. You can go on that page to do. All right. So back to the home page here, you have a little cart that shows once you have items in the cart to purchase. And you can actually log in and subscribe to the website. Um, here you will see this is usually on our landing page. We have the picture strolling of our headliners and our um, our whole entire structure lineup. So this year is headlining is um, Lisa Zahia and she is our headline for 2020 and then our instructors list here as well and you can always click and go across to see who our instructors for the year is and I believe if you click it the instructor's name comes up and then you can scroll through and see the name and the picture of the instructors for this year's event and that's the same way every year it works as you can clearly see here very easy to navigate not complicated all about just reading and paying attention yep so that's how you can see that when you click on it then it tells you here, so we had all access packages available on our store page. And also you could see the details of that on the workshop schedule page. Those were something that was limited and they are closed now for sign up, but we're gonna try to bring those back each year for people who are interested. Then here you'll find the schedule broken down of activities. So Friday we have the in intensives, which is something new that we've added this year starting on, on Friday. Um, and then we have the welcome party that night. And then it follows through to Saturday. Then it tells you what time workshops start and end. And then it tells you about the lectures that may be going on that day and what time they start. Then vendors shopping, what time it opens, what times it close. Um, and then the performance shows, what time they start. And generally about what time it may end. Though that can be, that really depends. So sometimes it can run a little over that time, but most of the time not. 
And then the after party, if there's one running, it tells you what time. And then on the next day, that breaks it down yet again about workshops, lectures, and performance show vending stays open both of those days for the same time. Then down here, when you scroll down, also this year we add the intensive section on the page so you know who's teaching the intensive. And we have two people teaching this year, um, Estella and Mighty. And then you scroll down further, then you'll see the team that puts everything together and um, our board, so to speak. So you have me, the CEO, COO, and HD. And then you have performance director, um, Anani Inaru. And then you have the administrative director, Aphrodite Lee, the head receptionist, Lori Jackson, staffing coordinator, Lynette Tillery, staffing assistant, Kim Tor, and EMC. Currently, it's Jessica Crow. Now, staff has stayed the same for quite a while. We've grown a little bit. The staff tends to change time to time, but these are the faces of the people that you would see at the convention that you may need to reach for any of these specific things. Of course, being a CEO, I can reach, I can be reached for any of these um, categories as I'm involved in all of them. Now we have had a community poll, so we have that down here. You can read a little bit about what people say about the convention, and this is one of our pictures from one of our previous years. Then you can click on down here. You see the photos from previous years to check out what happens. Then you have our copy right down here, um, a privacy policy. And then if you ever want to subscribe to our newsletter, which is really good to do to find out what's going on with the convention and updates, you can just put your email in this little box here and press the subscribe button and you will be subscribed. Really simple. All right. So going on to the one of the most used pages, is the workshop schedule page, I will click that. And you click that directly and not the sub pages that pop up by highlighting it. So you scroll down here. And this tells you pricing of packages. Now, this is the only page that tells you that except for the shop and register page. Now, this here is a very basic breakdown of them. The details for the bigger packages are higher over here. So if you look here, it tells you about when the tiers end, the prices change, and the date of prices come into effect. This needs to be updated, obviously, right now, which would need to be done soon. And then you have the workshop three pack, a four pack, a six pack, then a troop pack, a duo pack. And did we take the duo pack? Is here anymore? It may not be. I think it might close. Okay. So we have the troop pack, and then we have the um, weekend gym pack. Um, weekend pass, which is really good for people who really want to take a lot of things. Then we had these are the intense, the um, include all inclusive workshop packages they are sold out then we have the um intensives right here so it breaks you down how much the intensives are and then what they consist of and you know what they're what's being taught that year and then over here is usually what our biggest packages are and this this also you always look for this something marking how many months are left for payment plans because we offer payment plans starting usually the previous year that the convention so let's say the convention is in july we start opening payment plans at around november or so or a little bit before it depends so we'll give you a option for an eight to nine month payment plan and it works its way down the closer the convention gets for those options so the earlier you can get to sign up for a payment plan and the better for you for us if you have a budget and you want a higher price package now over here, you'll see our biggest packages. Like this year, you have the Unicorn VIP Master Package, and it comes with a whole lot of stuff. You save a lot of money. It comes with a hotel stay. Just to read all about that is really really cool, especially if you are a person who wants to do almost everything at the convention. You get some swag and merchandise, really cool stuff. Um, and then our secondary package was the Mythical Package. It's a little bit lower than the other package, but it also includes a lot of cool stuff as well. Um, then you scroll down, you can see the schedule. So you see Friday schedule broke down with time, meal breaks, and what's happening. And then you scroll down further, you have Saturday with all the workshops that's happening that day, rather there's a lecture going on otherwise. And then Sunday is the same thing. And at end of every page, you can still sign up for the newsletter. So we try not, so no one will forget that. Um, all right, so moving on to the instructor page. 
So the instructor page follows suit where you see what year it is and the instructor bios are here. If you don't see a bios because we have to get it from the instructor and if we haven't received it at that time and then um, most cases you can click on that and it goes to their private Facebook pages. Well, not private, but the page that they give us for us. That's like their dancer page or they, maybe their standard Facebook page or their website if they have one. So you'll scroll down. You can see the names and then their bios. Are very useful to find a little bit about the instructor. And again, like I said, you can click on if you don't see a bio there, click on the picture, it should take you to their um, Facebook page or website. You can find out a little bit about them. If you look in their bio, some people have links that you can click on. Okay, so that covers the instructor. Page and I will go down it one more time for you. And if you need to read any of these through there, you can just pause it, but you can always go on the website yourself. I'm just showing you where everything is. And we have a great selection this year, I must say. We like to keep variety is one of the one of the things we're known for. Variety, different styles of instructors throughout. Um, all right, so then you have the workshop description. Um, Saturday page. So this is all the workshops on Saturday's descriptions broken down. So you can scroll down. They have the title first for the workshop and then the description next to it. Try to keep it as basic looking as possible because it works better for the cell phone or something like that. So I like very complicated looking websites myself because they look more fancy and better. But a lot of people using mobile devices, you kind of have to try to keep things as basic as possible for those reasons. And then you have Sunday's workshops the same. So you can um, go to the website and check those out yourself and read descriptions before you select something, make sure it fits your needs. I'm gonna skip the mobile workshop schedule page because that's not really any point to that one right now. So home page, like I said, and then you can highlight the home page and there are like, the, there's three pages. There are three pages above the home page for making that four. So I clicked on the About DCBA page. When you scroll down, it gives you our vision and journey. You can read all about that, some pictures from the previous years. Um, and then another about our mission statement, a little bit about us and how we came to be and such like that. And then you can go to the testimonial page. Shows you testimonials of people who have, and it's loading a little bit, so I don't, yeah. Okay. So this gives the name of the person who said it at the bottom and then the words in which they stated. We have so many more, but I haven't added them to the page. But this gives you an idea of how some people feel about the convention so thus far, which I'm very happy that it's all good stuff. And then we have the sponsors page, which the sponsors change each year. So right now we do have Wild Media Group Co, which actually is involved in editing and performance videos. People will sign up for those. And then, of course, my website design page is always sponsoring us. Um, then the Youth Summit page, which is like, like I explained, is a new page. And it shows the a little bit more detail about the event location, which is our same location for the convention. And then this shows you the dates and times and how it works. And then this is a link to register your child for space. And then, um, yeah, so that gives you a basic thing of what that's about. And you can go read about it a little bit more when you get a chance to check the website. And this is our media page here. Okay, so we have a um, team of photographers that are amazing, Stereo Vision Photography. You may or may not have heard of them. I'm not sure how you haven't because they are amazing. And um, they do some of the best photos around, as you can even see here on the slideshow. They are very good. And they've been with us from the beginning, um, I think, in 2015. So almost the very beginning, because we started in 2014. So they are very reliable and known for their amazing work. So you definitely want to sign up for the photos. And it's a reasonably, beyond reasonably priced. So you can go in there and check out that. And then they have we have the two links for those. You can sign up. 
And then we have um, the Curve Capture Production, which is going to be doing the videos this year for the convention. Um, and it's our own um, built company because we're very it's very reliable for us to have on hand all the time. We try not to switch our um, videographer every year. So this year we built our own team for editing the videos, who's a very professional company, been doing it for 25 years or more. And then the prices are $30 and you get a link through the um, internet sent to you not long after the event is over. So we try to keep it reasonably, reasonably priced and um, very simple to fill out. So that's something else for you to check out. And then we have the venue page. So this shows the outside of the hotel, um, Delta Marriott Hotel. And we have to, this has to be updated so you can book through the website, but um, calling works this as well. And it's a, probably a glitch here to do with the box, but that'll be fixed if we can probably visit that. Um, so as you can see here, the inside of the hotel a little bit, and then some of the rooms, and then the bar, restaurant area, and then have a gym, and they have a pool, indoor, outdoor pool, a lot of cool stuff, but you can go check all that out when you get a chance. And then we have the apply to perform page. All right, so on this page is really basic, it explains about signing up and how um, signing up to for workshops help the convention immensely and the instructors very specifically. And they are coming from far and wide to teach people their amazing skills. So show your support by signing up for workshops by them. This is how we get people coming to the convention for us instructors by people signing up for workshops. Um, these are community-based events and need help of the community. So people signing up keeps these events going. So definitely you want to perform, please do think about signing up for workshops. Um, we are very limited on space for performance shows is another thing. So we have to give space to those who sign up for workshops first. And um, yeah, we have two shows, but they get filled really quickly for people who want to perform. And the, the one show is usually three hours, the other show is two hours. So you're trying to fit all the dancers in those two slots. So we definitely recommend signing up for workshops. And you can click on this link here to so apply to perform, space is limited. Um, and then it will take you to the form to fill out. All right, moving right on to the shop and register page. All right, so the shop and register page is really basic and self-explanatory. You can see when we have new arrivals come in, prices are right below. And you can read about each description. You can do a quick view, click on any of these items. And then you can see here when we do different little small fundraiser events that are on here. Then the food orders, the merchandise, you can load more because there's always more. It tells you when something is out of stock, like this and let's get intensive weekend pass. And then you have lectures here and the performance video is purchased here when you are a performer and you want to sign up for a video recording. Then you have the packages all here. And yeah, it's um, yeah, very easy to, to do and follow through. So very basic. And if you click on one of them, let's say we'll click on this one here. It will take you to another page and then it gives you a slight description of what you're purchasing and explains that to you. Yep. So really basic. And then when you click on it, it goes into your cart. All right. I think um see if I forgot anything. Oh, the food offerings page. That's the last page we'll have to do. And this will show you show tickets and food offerings. Intensive menu comes with purchase of either Friday intensive lecture. Lunch comes with assigned lecture. Um, dinner at performance shows can be purchased or not. Please go to the shop and register page to make purchases. Thank you. So you, this shows you a picture of what you're getting, like so the menu, what time it's served, and the day in which it's served. The, this this one here specifically is for the intensive. It comes this food comes with the intensive when you have dinner. And then it shows you what day, what event this happens with, and so on and so forth. Okay. 
So that will conclude our tour of the DCBA convention website. Please go check it out yourself. I'm going to stop screen share. <laughs> So thank you for taking that tour with me. That was about 24 minutes of a tour. Um, so yeah, go to www.dcbaconvention.com and give it a go. Just simply scroll through. If you need this tutorial along with you, just open this um, video up and then go to the website and it should help you navigate it quite easily. Um, the, the website is not that difficult to actually navigate you just have to take your time and read the tabs and see what's what and click on it and see what helps you so that's why i wanted to do this video to make sure you wouldn't have too much of a problem also we are easily to be con contacted for any information if you still find it difficult to navigate the website do not hesitate to email one of us at dcba dance gmail.com at gmail.com and or Go to one of our fan pages or convention pages on Facebook. Um, we're, they're always being monitored, and you can contact them. I'll be myself or one of the other admins. All right. Thank you, and we hope to see you at DCBA. Have a good one.